Okay, so in just a few moments, a game of Sharky Peninsula is going to commence. So here we go. The loading screen. So this is going to be played in a 64 player match on the game mode uh, Conquest in Assault Large. Okay, so here I am synchronizing with the server. Uh, this the, this was a live commentary, but I was uh, playing with uh, my friends on TeamSpeak, so I re completely removed the sound of uh, them speaking and me speaking. So I dodged the uh, TV missile. My out missed the TV missile too, and I can't seem to get a range on the enemy chopper. My out failed again, and now uh, as the situation. Doesn't seem favorable. I will jump and I will parachute on top of this guy, trying to get his start as a sniper in the match. Although he had a very bad start with me killing him there. So now their chopper is attacking us, and I'm kind of far from the action here. But eventually. I'll get there. This video uh, will look better. The 720p video will look better than uh, most 720p videos because it was recorded in 1080p with anti aliasing on. So there's, if you look at the video, there is no. Oh, there's literally, literally no anti, no always. Uh, did you break the wall? So yeah, I cut the volume down from my microphone and their microphone, and I'm doing a commentary over my video. It doesn't seem natural at all because I don't have the. I, Usually my inspiration of commenting comes while I am playing, but I guess, yeah, I killed the guy there, the people on the minimap, they're coming from this side, the guy jumped there, I thought he could get me at Rambo, but he didn't. There, I don't know what I was doing, but I guess I didn't react fast enough to that guy over there. going to spawn a Charlie in the middle of the action, which is perfect. Throw a grenade right there. Annoy the enemy with the grenado. And the in-game uh, voice chatter from the soldiers is in French because I have the French version of the game. But yeah, that's I just said it. <laughs> Watching the beautiful sun glare as I moved towards uh, G with uh, G the Grief. I gave there a squad order. Doesn't really change that much, but I wouldn't say it's useless. It allows other other players to see. Uh, you can see on top of each objective uh, only squad orders, now, so you can have an idea of uh, how the team is uh, splitting up to uh, attack or defend objectives on the map. Here, uh, so we are going to, we are deciding to go on top of the tower, that's uh, Jeef the Grief's dream, he wants the chopper on this map, he always wants the chopper, whatever the map, the chopper is, yeah, it's his, the thing he probably enjoys the most in Battlefield, but generally, so, Told him, you know the chopper isn't even gonna spawn since we don't have the flag. So I will take the flag. He's like, that's why I count you to do. You take the flag while I take the chopper. That's why he's like, okay. Right. Got down here. The chopper didn't really, probably didn't see me because he has enough area of effect to completely destroy me. And now I'm probably gonna die. Oh. Okay. 
I could record in 1080p, but uh, if I wanted to keep like my uh, hard disk write speed isn't fast enough for it to uh, re to write the to yeah to write the video to the hard disk. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm just gonna start over. Well, uh, my hard disk isn't write speed isn't fast enough for me to record on uh, 30 FPS 1080p on it, so. Uh, it works, but the frame rate is gonna. It's not gonna stay at the uh, NDB. Oh, do you see that C4 over there? I saw it. I was like, oh shit, there's another one here. But the guy basically wasn't even here anymore. He anticipated our arrival. But, uh, we didn't come fast enough. He died somewhere. I run my way and died. I guess I'm gonna jump, yep. The chopper is probably gonna strike again. I heard the uh, explosions. It's a bunch of enemies at G. Guy there. But, yeah. The my havoc. Caused havoc once again. He revived me there. Thanks. Just for the havoc to have a little bit. So now we're down to two objectives. They have uh, five objectives. Almost. They're gonna take G. Go. That thing died before my rocket. Guy over there. Apparently good at aiming in long range, so positioning, not there anymore, minding his own business, which is not kill, loss, stay off at all costs. Keep firing there, that really did not pay off, but didn't get me killed. My health just finally starts to recharge, take another guy out here. So I record in 720p at 30 frames per second because the frame rate is stable, it stays at the maximum that you do. As as you see it right now, it's not lagging, so that's why I'm not recording 1080p. Take another guy after randomly changing subjects. But it's, that's not why I was playing. Here <laughs> more bunch more guys. Usually if you wanna know uh how because I'm consistent in the games, it's not random. When you when you know where to go in the game, it's because you look on the minimap, you know what's going on, and the minimap is a great tool for you to know better what's going on. Now Keith blocked me, and thankfully he revived me again. Well, that were those were a lot of rockets, and just two choppers passed above me. Definitely not gonna get revived there. A guy, a, a sniper, choppers, and then a tank. And I think he just got under VG off. Gonna spawn on E. Now, as you can see, I'm probably not gonna win this match. The team all together is. Cannot compete good, well enough with the other team. Have a. A chance of winning. But it's like we're gonna get spawn camp, but they're gonna win. Doesn't stop the game from being fun. Get here a guy. Map. Blew up his cover. Finished him off. Take an hour to recharge. Uh, slow recharging. Small. Put down some suppressive fire on this one guy here. Trying to go somewhere. A bunch of guys there running for their lives. Killed that guy there. Just as he almost went behind cover. 
And maybe he did in his stream, but you know what it is. You can't have perfect echo. It's impossible the way the internet functions. Here I look down. See a guy. Go after him. See another coming. Decide to go for a fast revive. I know the guy's gonna come. Decided to come that side. Got me. And now Geef. Maybe going to save me. I don't know what happened there, but he didn't save me. I decided to take the stinger. So, well, there's a tank, but I'll take the stinger. I think taking the stinger wasn't such a good idea. There's a chopper there, dude. I don't know what he was doing right now. Killing infantry, I guess, but. Maybe I should, uh, if I fired better right there, I could have killed, I could have saved that demon from being knifed. Yeah, I, may, I should have, uh, shot at the chopper, maybe. But I guess Stinger doesn't really help for your survival, like a small does. You know, if you don't shoot the choppers. It's like when you don't kill enemies in the ranges. It's okay. If you don't kill an enemy in close range, well, you're dead. If you don't kill an enemy in long range, well, Shoots you maybe and then you get cover or you don't need to kill the chopper to survive. It's just but if there's a tank, you probably screwed if he's after you and you have no RPG. Unless he changes his mind, he's like, oh fuck, that guy's too hard to go and kill and stops going after you. Uh, he's gonna kill you if you don't if you can't fight back. The team doesn't attack him, doesn't stop him. If nothing stops him, he's gonna kill him. Okay. I'm back playing with assault now, as I will be using the very useful medkit. As I, I also that guy died, before. but I turned around to go kill, to go revive him, and also I had nowhere. Not many. Not where else to go. Nowhere else to go. Dude, I don't know what's going on. Sorry about. Fail. Commentary fails. Kinda knew it this way. Amazing tap fire there. Thought that's the best of the world, but it's fairly decent. Get revived. Yeah, dude, it's, it's nice to have someone to play with. Got completely <laughs> obliterated. But in Battlefield, your body survives that kind of explosion. You know, it just falls down the hill. It's okay, you can get revived after, no problem. Guy with his laser sight there. Oh shit. And Give the Creep is still alive. Dude, he's totally. Still alive there. He probably went like AFK, and now he he went he uh, went back up from prone. Yeah, I guess he he had the same ending as I did. But, uh, destroy. What I need to destroy the move. Revive. This guy and get sniped by surprise by this group. You see, when there are more teammates around, the more teammates they're around, the more uh, you. It, it, you don't really have to watch that much around you, depending on the. You know, if usually you're not sure if there's an enemy, there's like a one percent chance there is, and you would watch. If there's uh, teammates around, just don't watch. It's okay, you know. In the worst case scenario, if there is one and he doesn't get killed and kills you. You know, you'll just get revived most of the time. Right, guys, okay. The thing is, if you spend time always watching around for yourself, you're basically gonna end up doing nothing for the game. So the best, what I do is I, I try to prioritize how important it is. Because while you're looking at the side, you're not looking at the front too.
this guy. I need to stop uh, him firing there. There's at least one bullet that missed. Always. I just started down hip firing uh, lately. I just it's it's like a way uh, call it a 100 the extinct yeah. It's like oh it's okay I will kill him anyways and start stop firing. Yeah, I see the guy. Yeah. Look around a little. Try to go up the stairs, but I kind of fail. The Taking Delta. Getting surprised by the guy on my left. No, but seriously, when, when I climbed up the stairs and everything, it looked so calm. I was like, okay, I'll just capture the flag. Spawn on my squad mate here. The climber on top of me. But I could show a grenade, but there's enemies. And better things to hit. Okay, now I'm just gonna speed run up before that thing decides to kill me with area of effect. What I managed to get up. Back where I died a few moments ago. And uh... Kind of afraid of snipers. The day I played on, on this server, the, I got killed by snipers. Way more than usual. So I really didn't feel safe up here. Try not to, to stay stationary. Like, decrease the chance. And hopefully, if he fires, he will miss his first bullet. And I, I won't get super surprised. I have no time to. Because if, if I hear a sniper shoot me, I will. I will move more, uh, change position turn around and try to kill him. I, mean, I have a certain hey, aim that allows me to extend uh, my range farther yeah, away than uh, my close range. Like farther away than usual. Like I, I can bring a pistol in long range. I wouldn't do that, it's not... The range on the pistol is like crap. Except for like the Magnum. Especially, I know for sure that the scope one has a long range. It means it has the same range as an assault rifle. Just because it has a scope one. And I think the one, the 44 Magnum without the scope does not have a long range. It has a low range. Like every other handgun. handgun. Kill this guy here. He was recharging his weapon. Everything it was over. That guy Jerry just flew. Wow. And he was also lagging, he was like uh, mi he was uh, having micro slaughtering or he was flying in the air. So to go this way. Of course the guy's dead. I mean that that team in there, the engineer, just put his entire mag into that person. See the chopper. You know, things you notice in the game you just doesn't really affect you. Like, okay, there's a chopper, I might get there strike. Too bad. What, what am I really gonna do about it? Hide in the house and do nothing? Oh, I get revived. That kid didn't save me. That guy looks, whether he has, maybe he has no ammo, but he looks uh, 
Like someone that is dedicated to using any getting really good with his pistol. But I'm committing this one by recording uh, off uh, TeamSpeak Tree by myself. It's kind of awkward if someone comes in. And while that, I'm watching the video I just recorded. I hope it will be synchronized. Turn around, try to get a few guys, although I'm pretty vulnerable. I decided to go towards there to grab the guys. BTR uh, just had this. just moved away. You know the, these drivers that have uh, the. They just always move. Okay? But sometimes it makes no difference and there's even a disadvantage. Just randomly moving like that. I mean, it's good to move when you know you're probably gonna dodge an RPG or annoy an enemy trying to act to get an opportunity to shoot at you. But you don't always have to do it. It's not always good. It's not necessary. So don't do it without thinking. That's that's all. So this was the end of uh, the round on Sharky Peninsula. If you enjoyed the video like the video if you want to stay up to date with my videos subscribe and also comment uh, just find anything to say it does, I really enjoy receiving feedback